Lanternfish are small silver fish that look like sardines or anchovies, except with bigger eyes. They are very abundant midwater fish found throughout the world's oceans. There are about 250 species. Since all lanternfish are similar in shape, it can be difficult to discern between species. They have rows of spots along their bodies that glow in the dark. They are the most common fish in the twilight zone and estimated to be the most abundant vertebrates on the planet. Lanternfish play an important ecological role as prey for larger organisms. Every night, most species embark on a mass vertical migration. They migrate from the deep midwater, around 3,000 feet where food is sparse, to shallower depths near the surface during the night where food is abundant. Actual migration depths can vary greatly by species. They migrate at night to feed on zooplankton when sunlight no longer penetrates the shallows. They return back to the deep midwater during the day to avoid predation from larger animals. Lanternfish play a key role in regulating the climate. By swimming up and down each day, they boost the biological carbon pump. Lanternfish glow in the dark because they can produce their own blue-green light. This is called bioluminescence. They may possess two kinds of bioluminescent organs that light up independently. The mostly ventral, primary photophores are well developed, while smaller, less developed, luminous tissues are distributed over the body. Luminous organ patterns vary between species, and sometimes between the sexes. Light is produced when a light-producing compound called luciferin is oxidized with the help of an enzyme called luciferase. They use light for seeing prey and predators, for camouflaging themselves, and for communication. Lanternfish usually grew up to 6 inches long. Some live for less than 2 years. They are eaten by animals like sharks, tuna, whales, and salmon. Despite their abundance, lanternfish are far too oily and full of spiky bones to be considered good food fish. They could be used as animal feed for fish farms. Their wax is sometimes used in the cosmetics industry. However, they actively avoid being caught and swim away from open nets, so there are few places that target them commercially. For more marine facts, click the subscribe button.